Berkeley has completely transformed me and I really think that I can hardly recognize the person I was four years ago. I feel more confident in being able to do the things that I want to do. I found this you know, tremendous passion for math. And I've also been involved with community service and more service activities than, than I would have ever expected myself to be. You look at the triangular decomposition into U minus. Um... When I look at an interesting math problem, I think first of all, like anybody, it, it can be intimidating depending on the problem. But then if the problem is sufficiently interesting, I think it just kind of like takes over your mind. One of these reductive algebraic groups we were talking about. Just Walking like along campus when you're like in the middle of a conversation, even like in the middle of your sleep, it's basically, if there's one problem that you want to solve, that's, it's basically all you are. <laughs> When I was in high school, when I was a teenager, I think I really struggled a lot with self-doubt and anxiety issues that you know, kind of crippled me to some extent and really prevented me from you know, seeing a purpose or like seeing a motivation to do the things, to do anything really. Zero-dimensional subspace and a one-dimensional subspace. As soon as I came to Berkeley, it was like an immediate click. I was just so engaged by the kind of academic discourse that happens here. I was you know, just kind of in awe immediately of the professors and how much they knew and I would just try to soak up everything that, that I could. One of my favorite things about playing the harmonium is the style of music is completely improv, so the, the complete creative freedom you have when you're playing is one of the greatest appeals to me. And I think in many senses, it makes it very similar in, in, in many ways to research mathematics and science in that there's you know, no clear rules, no definite bounds or you know, nothing like that. It's you know, more or less all open frontier and you know, yours to discover and explore. <laughs> Most of the, the campus community here is so you know, invested emotionally, personally, and they're so passionate about social issues. And you have a community of students here who really feel like they can make a difference and, and actually go out and do make the difference in the world. From my freshman year, I've been volunteering at Bahia, which is an after-school program for elementary school-aged Hispanic and Latino children. And we've sort of been working with them on like English and language arts activities, and that's been undoubtedly one of the most meaningful experiences of my time at Berkeley. What does this sequence converge to point-wise? Then the GKs converge. My next plan is to begin a PhD program at MIT in mathematics, and my dream after that is to hopefully one day become a professor and be doing math research full-time. Represent the limit if it exists, but I mean, people also use it. I'm certainly very sad to be leaving Berkeley, but I think I'll definitely leave a different person. I'll leave, to some extent, always carrying Berkeley with me.